All right, so the third um, bag of chords in the key of what? D, key of D, because the key of D has two sharps. Uh, and it's basically, we started from C to G, now it's D, logically, right? So let's, let's, go, let's go ahead and listen to it first, and then we'll try to learn it together, yeah? The first chord. D, then go to E minor, F sharp minor, G. To A, B minor. Let's let's do this is for the first time. It's gonna be diminished chord, C sharp diminished. How do you play that? You're gonna skip the the sixth string, then you're gonna cover fourth fret, four five four five, four five four five, yeah, and then back to back to D. Good. Okay, let's go one more time. So, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's gonna diminish. Yeah, it's gonna be diminished and back to one. Yeah, so this is the back of chords in the key of D. You need to learn that again in order to be comfortable in the key of D. As long as um, your chords are disconnected from each other or they don't have a context, you will have trouble to just connect this, you know, bunch of chords. Um, but music also, you know, as live as other things is logical. And if you logically connect those chords together, or at least you are playing the chords from the one from one key, then your music, your chords will sound much better, smoother um kind of like one piece of art right so okay well see you in the next video this is the third video there's going to be maybe one or two more so you know what to do see you